Hey, what's going on, guys? Um, today I will be showing my collection of metal CDs and metal vinyl or records. So, first off, I'm going to be starting with Rain and Blood by Slayer. Um, it's a really good album. Uh, next, we have Motorhead Overkill. Next we have Kill Em All. Master of Puppets. Iron Maiden, A Matter of Life and Death. Pretty cool how it has a collage of all the band members right here playing all their instruments. Pretty cool. Next we have Death Human. Came with a little pamphlet but, and I hung it up with my wall. And I plan to get all the albums and then hang up all the little, little pamphlets together and make like this kind of death collage out of a poster. Black Sabbath, self-titled. I am playing this, well, not playing it, but it's on my record player currently, so it's not in here. Yeah, it's got a really cool inside, I think. Now we're moving on to my CDs. I'm, now we're moving on to my CDs. I have a huge deck of CDs. Most of them are my dad, I pro dad's. I probably have about 40, 40 CDs that are metal. I'm not including hair metal. But I will be including new metal. So first off we have Pantera, Far Beyond Driven. Next we have Nine Inch Nails, The Downward Spiral. This one comes with a little pamphlet. Oh, and Far Beyond Driven came with a poster that I hung up on my wall. A little pamphlet for the lyrics and everything. Pretty cool. They have this. For some reason, the cover of this just gives me the creeps. This album, it's it's, it's pretty insane. Like, it is an ins insane album. Might do a review on it eventually. Next, we have the deluxe edition, I believe, of Hardwired. Currently, I have a disc in there, too. Yeah, I'm not good at picking stuff up. It came with this pamphlet, which I was really hoping was a poster. But it wasn't. Just kind of a collage. Of all sorts of stuff with their lyrics. It's a really cool pamphlet, though. Next, we have Black Sabbath Greatest Hits. From 1970 to 1978. Came with a cool booklet. I really love the color that this album is. The artwork is awesome, I think, too. Next, we have Ride the Lightning. I plan to get this on record. Yeah, it's got all this stuff. Another kind of collage like there uh, is normally on Metallica. Excuse me. Next we have Slipknot, Iowa. Haven't listened to this yet. My dad got it for me because my dad likes Slipknot and I used to like them a lot. Don't like them nearly as much as I used to, but they're still a decent band. Pretty cool artwork, I think. And have that. <sighs> then we have my DIY CD. I still need to make a video on that. I did, but I didn't post it because I couldn't make a good thumbnail. Thumbnail. So yeah, Painkiller from the Classic Five Albums CD set. Next we have Anthrax, The Sound of White Noise. Yeah, it's a, okay for Anthrax, but it came with a poster, which I hung up on my wall, of course. You can probably see my wall back there. I've got a pretty big wall now. 
Yeah, I got I got a lot of stuff on my wall now. Still gotta hang up my Slatonic War mocked poster though. Something bad happened to it. It's like Yeah. So this is Ozzy Osbourne, the Osmosis. I believe it's an okay album. It comes with a sheet inside. Is this poster? So I'm gonna check all these if they're posters. We'll probably have, but I just forgot. Never listened to this album. Don't know if I will. It is Rob Zombie American Music to made a strip by. It's got some pretty nice artwork though. And it's pretty cool how the inside you can open it up and it looks like someone spat a fruit roll up on there. <laughs> Next we have <coughs> another DIY uh, or die. Screaming for Vengeance by Judas Priest. Next we have Pantera, official live 101 proof. Came with a poster, hung that up on my wall. Um, yeah, Pantera albums seem to normally come with posters. <coughs> and yeah, the, uh, I'm, the CD, I don't know if you guys can see or not, because I have a bad front camera on my phone. But it's like, oh, looks like someone took wax on it. But I can still play it to like song number 8 or 10. Next we have Master of Puppets. Now we have Godsmack 1000 horsepower. Pretty killer. I don't know about this artwork though. My dad really likes this for some reason. It's pretty cool though. That's the sound of my CDs falling over. Next we have Judas Priest Unleashed in the East, live in Japan. Another die or DIY one that I made. Oh, they really fell over. Another DIY uh, Defenders of the Faith. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool. Still falling over. <coughs> Next we have A Decade of Destruction by Five Finger Death Punch. It's alright. Not a fan of these guys that much though. Keep in mind I'm sitting on one of these stools on the lowest step. So this is very fun right now. Um next we have Ozzy Osbourne, No More Tears. a mess to clean up. Next we have Black Sabbath 13, their last album they ever decided to make. It's got this really cool inside. And then, oh, I bet this will show up really good on the camera. Oh, because in one view, you can see the, you can see it normally not burning at all. It's kind of hard to get there though. So, there's that. And next we have Follow the Leader by Korn. I really like the artwork on this. The CD's not in here though. That sucks. I don't even know where some of the CDs are. So all of these are my dad's. <coughs> Next we have Smells Like Children by Marilyn Manson. Yeah, this is literally all that's in the front. It's pretty cool though. It's, I hope someone's like counting these as I'm going down. Next we have White Zombie, Astro Creek 2000. Rob Zombie is king of artwork, I think. He got he has the best artwork I have seen. Next we have System of a Down. System of a Down, I believe. Mm. 
Next we have Ozzy Osbourne, the Ozman comic. And we're getting down to the last two CDs. Metallica, Kill 'Em All. That happened. Oh. And I just broke through the CD. Yeah. And last but not least, Injustice for All by Metallica. Um, that is it so far. Um, I do plan to get Splatter Thrash by Ghoul on CD or record, but, oh, well, I also have Creator Hell to the Hordes EP on a picture disc, and I also have... Okay, yeah, I got everything, just making sure. So that's my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.